Hey, it's Kat. So before this, I tried recording two videos of myself singing, and then I came to the conclusion I'm not a very good singer. But I still wanted to make a video. And I realized that people don't really watch my videos anyway. So it's like I'm basically talking to myself. So it doesn't really matter what I say. But I had an idea of something I wanted to talk about. Because I think we all want to be good at something. I know I do. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. I want to be really good at something and like put all I can into it and like make something of myself. And I don't know, does anyone else feel that way? I, I don't know. It could be just me. But... I'm starting to realize that we all are good at different things. We all have different skills, we all have different talents, different gifts, and we can't all be good at the same thing. Not everybody can sing. I, I'm not one of those people. I'm not musically gifted. I cannot play an instrument for the life of me. I've tried, I even failed band class, and I went every day. How do you fail a class that you attend every day? Because I am that bad. I cannot play the flute. And then when we had a concert thing, they gave me a triangle. One of those little things that like dings. And they told me to stand in the back because I was literally an embarrassment. That's how bad I am at playing music. So as much as I want to be this musical person, I just don't have that in me. I'm kind of still trying to find what I'm good at because I like to think I'm good at a lot of things. I, I like to think that I can bake well and that people enjoy what I make. The truth is there was a New Year's party like I guess almost a year ago now and I made these cookies, right? I have no idea what went wrong and I should have tried one before I brought them there and I also put lime green icing on which probably didn't help but anyway so I brought them there and there's this girl and she's like 12 and she takes a bite she's like this here is what I think of your baking and she walked to the garbage can and she spit it out and she put the rest of the cookie in there and then I tried one and I realized that something went horribly wrong I, I don't know what so baking's not really my thing either pretend I know things that I know nothing about. Like when someone's talking about something, I just kind of try to use elaborate words. I usually don't even know what I'm talking about. And they look at me like I know what's going on. I never know what's going on. I don't even know what I'm talking about half the time. I barely even know what I'm talking about right now. But the point I was trying to get at is wanting to be good at something. And maybe some of us aren't good at anything. No, that's not what I was trying to get at. You gotta find it in you. But the thing is, why does it seem like some people almost like, it's like they matter more. It's like they're more important. Like they're special. We're all people. We're all human. Doesn't matter your race, your age, your background, your history, your family life. Doesn't matter your career or lack of career. Doesn't matter if you finish school or if you've got 82 degrees. Like, why does that change the fact that we are all human? We all have something to offer. We can all contribute something to society. I don't really like society, but apparently we're part of it. We are society. So, why complain about it when we could do something to make things better? Use your skills, use your talents. If you're kind, then show people kindness. If you are good at music, then play your music. If you can bake, then bake people cookies. Like, you know, like everybody's got something. And I feel like the biggest loser in the world. I haven't finished high school. I don't have a job. I really don't do much. I honestly feel like I messed up my whole life, but it doesn't have to be that way. Just because I made some really poor choices along the way doesn't mean that I'll
I'll never get anywhere. I might think really low of myself, but I mean, I can use what I've been through to become someone, to do something, to make some kind of difference. Because now I have compassion for people who are where I was at. And before, I probably wouldn't have understood. I wouldn't have cared. People say like, you know, oh, I can't, I can't stop drinking, for example. I would have been like, well, just stop. Like, just, just don't, just don't do it. And I've had people tell me that too. Just don't do it, just stop. And it's not that simple. And now I get that. I get what it's like to have a broken heart, to break someone's heart because I've been broken. And I can have compassion on other people who are hurting. And that's what I mean by using the pain to do something. Like somebody comes to me and they got this issue. It's like, man, like I, I feel you, I understand. And I can try to be empathetic, make that person feel like, you know what, you're not alone. Nobody is alone in this world. And why, why is it like we get so focused on ourselves? I mean, maybe it's just me. I, I, sometimes I get really focused on myself. I forget about anything going on around me and it's like, I have all these problems, I have all these issues, I, I need to figure things out, I need to be in control. And it just makes things so much worse. There's like a whole world out there, why do I need to focus on me all the time? You know? Like, I realized that in destructing my own self, I was hurting those around me without even realizing it. Because I was so self-absorbed that I couldn't see the damage I was causing. And like, I'm still trying to find out what it is I'm good at. I don't know. I like to think I'm good at making videos, but nobody really watches them. So, I know. I mean, I can do it because I like it. Maybe, maybe it's not so much about being good at something as it is about enjoying it. I like to sing. Do I have a good voice? No. But I enjoy it. When I'm sad sometimes, I just sing. Sometimes I just make up my own lyrics and I just jam out. And like, it... It's not because I'm going to be on the next Canadian Idol. Because if I went there, they would probably laugh at me. But, like, I just, I want to do something. I want to do something with my life. I want to make something of myself. And I may not know what that is, but I know that God has a plan. A plan that's bigger than I could ever even imagine. He has something in store for each one of us. He created you for a purpose. You are here for a reason. And how cool is it to think that before you were even born, he had a plan for your life. So like, let's just be who we are. Be who we are. You're good at being you. I'm good at being me. I'm weird. I like cats. Sometimes I like to eat too many cupcakes. Like, that's just me. And like, you be you. Because you is awesome. Just the way you are. So, I don't know if anyone's going to listen to this, probably not, I'm a bit of a loser, but at least I got to say something and I got to make a video without actually singing, so at least you didn't have to hear my singing voice, so be thankful for that.